Hello and welcome to my tutorial. Mr.NET is here and today I explain the adapter pattern in C Sharp. So for what we need the adapter pattern. For example, we have a client and this client will want to use this interface. But the client hasn't the expected type or object to use this interface. So for this, I set, I create an adapter that calls the interface. So this client calls the adapter, this adapter prepares the invoke from the client and call the interface. And for the adapter, we have two different implementations. We have the class adapter on the left side and we have the object adapter. The class adapter says that the adapter here inherits from the adaptees and the adaptee is an object which has a service what we as a client want to use but we can't it use. So we have here the interface and the client call through the interface the adapter and the adapter prepares my invoke from the client and call one of these adaptees. The object adapter is similar. The client calls the adapter through this interface and the adapter uses the adaptee interface to call the special service method here. So the client call the adapter, the adapter prepares the invocation and call through the adaptee interface here a special expected service. In the source code I implement the object adapter to explain it a little bit with a script. The class adapter I didn't implement because C Sharp hasn't a multiple inheritance but for my use case the object adapter will be enough I think. So now in the source code I have here an interface called iCalculator and this interface is my adaptee interface. That's the adaptee. And this adaptee provides a method calculate value and this method takes an argument value from type integer. And the method returns an integer. Now I have two classes which implements the i calculator and this classes provides the service what i want to use this class is for example the client this client here so now i want to use the i calculator for example i create an instance of a calculator and I have a property from type float called number 5.12 and I want to calculate the number with the method calculate value number and the problem is the type is not allowed with this method. Of course I can use a casting here but I want to show you an example of the adapter so for this example I say that the conver converting or the casting of this number is a little bit complicated. So I can't use this method directly. 
So I have to implement an adapter that changes this value so that I can use the calculator. Okay, I implement an interface, the target. And that, this is this interface here. And this interface provides a method which has the same name like the calculator, but the argument is not from type integer, it is from type float, because my number here is also from type float. And as a next, I need the adapter class, and this adapter class implements the target interface. So I have to implement the method and in this method I have to prepare this value so that I can call the calculator. So for this example I cast only the value to an integer and I have to call a calculator. So the adapter has a private property called underline calculator and this calculate will, calculator will be set in the constructor as an argument I calculate uh, calculator this underline calculator is calculator so now I can use here in this method the private property calculator and call the calculate value method and the return value is also from type integer so I can return the result of my calculator method so that's my adapter now I can use this adapter, adapter as a client adapter and the adapter needs a calculator so I give the calculate instance to the adapter constructor as an argument and now I can call the adapter calculate value method with my property here. So the benefit is I can now use the iCalculator implementations without changing these methods, classes or objects. I only implement a new adapter with an interface and the client can use this the concrete implementation of my adaptees through my adapter result console i show only the output On the console yes we see the number 25 because after the casting the values behind the comma will be deleted or will be cutted that's an explicit ca casting okay that is the adapter pattern. I hope I explained it probably okay. Please write me some recommendation into the comments so I can improve my tutorials for you and hopefully I see you in the next tutorial. Bye!